Don't you also have hands that randomly float around when you're getting ready? No? Just me? Oh, weird. Hey guys, I'm Katherine Newton and this is Masked and Answered with Marie Claire. I'm kind of doing a press day for this movie Freaky, so it's a little exceptional right now that I have Irinelle right here doing ponytail. That's not usually how my mornings go, but here we are. Let me start with showing you what I'm going to use first. See this? It's Chanel Le Lift eye patches, and they're so cute, guys. <gasps> Look at these. They're jelly. Sometimes when I'm going to set, I will wear these under my sunglasses and I'll just arrive on set and uh, people will look at me funny. But what are you gonna do? Oh, they go the other way. <laughs> so I've already done them wrong. That tells you everything. Okay, like this. It revitalizes your under eyes and makes them hydrated and bright if you're like me with dark circles. Okay, I did them right now. Oh, they're so cute and they say Chanel. I feel very expensive. The first thing I like to do is I like to brush my teeth, which sounds like it's nothing, but then I like to drink a whole bottle of water or hot water with lemon. Someone, one of my friends told me to start doing that and it literally, it made me feel so much better. I used to just drink coffee right away, but now it's hot water with lemon. And then I like to cleanse my face with a toner and I like to put my daily moisturizer on. Um, and, I'll, and I use this before I put makeup on. It's a Chanel Hydra Beauty Cream. And it's really nice underwater because it makes your skin really moisturizer and it doesn't pill under makeup. Um, and then I'll rub it in with, with this. And this is really good for circulation on your face and to make your skin not so puffy. And it also just feels amazing. This is really nice Chanel Sublime Essence for extra moisturizer. I'll use both of them under makeup. I have these two products that you can just get at CVS. It's the, um, it's the Maybelline Great Lash Mascara, and they started using it on me on Big Little Eyes, and I and then I noticed that on every project they always had this mascara, and I love it because it's really, it's not thick. This is the Maybelline Brow Sculpt. You can just do this. That's all I do. So that's my, that's my morning routine with these things. My favorite at-home beauty ritual is I take a bath every night, no matter what time after a day on set, even if it's 5 a.m., I'll go home and take a bath. And I love to have a big sheet mask and I'll put it in the water so it's nice and warm and then I'll put it on my face for like 30 minutes. That's my favorite. I get acne breakouts all the time, so my approach to dealing with them is to always use the same products. When I find products that work for me, I don't like to switch it up because I don't wanna have a breakout. You just, you know, nobody wants a breakout. The number one thing for me to clear acne too is drinking a lot of water. The other thing I forgot to say in my morning routine is sunblock. I wear sunblock every morning. It's a clair de peau. So I just use a little bit and I mix it with my foundation and then you're good to go all day. SPF 50. That's right. The craziest beauty treatment that I've ever tried, I was going to say an oxygen facial, which my makeup artist Gina Brooke always brings intra cuticles. She brings us a machine and it pumps oxygen into your skin. And like, it makes everything just look flawless. All the pores go away. Look at that hair. She's bringing out the hair. <laughs> I want to show everybody. Look at the weaves that we have just on the bed. Yep. <laughs> We're ready. Just the daily hair and makeup routine. So that's the craziest thing I think I've ever done is the oxygen facials. It just makes everything look bright and shiny. One of my, I mean, my earliest memories, I mean, I've been getting my hair and makeup done since I was like four on set. So my earliest memories are always to just have fun and don't do anything that you don't like. Because if you don't like it, you're not gonna feel good in it. So, you know, because people always wanna paint your face the way they want to or something, but you know how you look best. And I love to take risks. I'm a big risk taker. So don't be afraid to have fun and just do what you want. Biggest beauty mistake I've ever made. Oh, I know. I was on set one time and I let someone paint my brows, like fill them in, and she used an orange red color and I looked like I had carrots on my face. It was not good. On camera, things look different, so you gotta be careful. Now I don't do anything to my brows. I just, I use a L'Oreal clear eyebrow gel and you can get it at CVS and that's just all I need. 
Oh, I love like the classics. I love Grace Kelly and Audrey Hepburn. I um, even Alexa Chung. I've always tried to copy like the French no makeup makeup look. That's like my go-to, just a little red lip. I use um, Chanel, it's number 178. I like to just put it a little bit around the lines and there's a little chapstick on my lips and I just rub it and now it just is like a little bit of a stain. The beauty advice I'd give to my younger self is always take your mascara off. It's not worth it. it. You will get a breakout, even though you think it's on your eyeballs and you think you're not gonna get a breakout, it's still dirt and it will clog your pearl pores. Don't leave it on because it looks good for that one time with your friends. You can do it again tomorrow. You can. So now is my time to take off my little eye patches, even though I would literally leave them on all day, just wear my sunglasses on top. Nobody would even say anything. It's just who I am. that see that shine oh, that's what you do them for also they're really just fun to do like with your friends while you're watching a movie thank you guys for watching Marie Claire's masked and answered I hope you had fun watching the video and I hope that you guys go see freaky Friday November 13th and um, don't forget your masks uh, wear an eye mask if you want it would make me really proud to see you guys out at the movie theater in your eye masks I think that would be hilarious and uh, I think I'm gonna start doing that. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos like this.